Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Amaka A M A K A, and today is going to be a very special session. I'm here with my grandma. Yay! So today we're going to be talking about. She's going to be giving advice to her. I get like advice on something that would benefit me. And I feel like it will benefit you too. So, so yeah. Hi, Grandma. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> okay. Um, um, number one, you know, uh, 20 years, um, I can say it's uh, an age which men runs after uh, someone. It's a hot cake age. That's what I can <laughs> say. Yes, it's a hot cake age. Because many wants, wants to you. Many will toast to you for marriage. Many will toast to you for just girlfriend, just to use you and dump you. The only thing I want you to know, which I did, and I feel it helps me a lot during the time of my age, when I was 20 years before I got married. One, you have to, you have, to have faith in God. You know, uh, this age is like second uh, missionary journey. You know, you will go through so many things. And you know, uh, missionary journey, you go with faith. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you go with faith. Uh, which I will say from the book of uh, um, Acts 16 verse 5, and you have to go with faith because without faith, that with, without faith, that age is is very is a delicate age because you won't know the right person to choose. You won't know the right person to choose. You have to take your time. You have to be prayerful. You have to be watchful. Which that was I did because many were after me during that time. I can say they are up to five. Wow. <laughs> yes, that at that time, you know, men rush women. So they were up to five. Then I take my time. I did not answer anyone. I went to prayer. I said, God direct me. I don't want to miss. I don't want to choose anyhow. Choose for me. Let me listen to your voice. You have to listen to the voice of the Lord to direct you. If without God directing, there's nothing you can do you will choose wrongly. Number one, as many as they come, you don't have to go out with them because it's very delicate. Mm. Yes, as uh, if you are able to go out with one, <laughs> it may be the one, the real one that wants to marry you because it happens to me, that's why I'm saying this. They, they can send them their friends which you don't know, go and toast her. Once you agree and you fall apart with that one, you will go back to tell the man, the one who is uh, maybe is willing to marry you, go and tell ah, oh, that lady, no, you can't marry her. She's very loose. <laughs> Do you know, I toasted her and she agreed. <laughs> I've gone out with her. Really, that one will cause failure, disappointment. Mm -hmm. We makes you to lose the rightful person. But two, you have to pursue uh, love and uh, desire spiritual gift to guide you. What does that mean? Spiritual mean, gift. Means spiritual gift is that let God speak to you. Mm. Yeah, seek for the face of the Lord. Seek for the desire of the Lord, and He will surely guide you. You can find that in the Corinthians 14 verse 1. If you read it, you will see it there. God will direct you. If you really pursue that one, love of God, and God's desire, spiritual gift, God will give it to you. And He will direct you because Holy Spirit doesn't misdirect anybody. He will put you right. He will choose, he will choose the right person for you. That is if you are half patient enough. Then number two, which I always told people, you will find out in Roma 8, 5. The power of believer is prayer 
is prayer in spirit. You have to pray in spirit. God, I want to marry. You don't have to hurry. Listen to God. Be patient. Surely God will answer you. He will direct you. And he will never, never mis misdirect you. Because it happened to me. At my age, as I told you, many were coming. I refused. I said, no, I haven't got the rightful person. And people of my age, a lot of them, people that I've seen at that time, they got married. <laughs> I tell you today, many of them, they, they have remarried up to two or three men. Oh. Yes, it happens to them. Two or three men. And as they're married, they, they have children for them. You know? So today, their children, they have problem because wow. of that. Yes. Mm. Because one of my sisters involved in that situation. Yes. I told them, you don't need to hurry in marriage. Your age. They will say, ah, because that's what they used to tell. Once you are 20 years, they say, ah, oh, your, all your mate has married. You have not got married. Ah, you want to do this. You want to do that. You don't want to marry. Maybe you want to do, uh, you want to be high lot. You know, they will say all sorts of things. But don't ever listen to them. Just your own is that have faith and be patient that God will direct the rightful man to you. Yes. And another advice, don't ever allow anyone to choose for you. Because their choice, they, that person's choice may not be your choice. Some people, some, we, some girls, they marry because that man is handsome and uh, that man has money. Is living a, 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 a buoyant life. That's what many ladies go after. In that, they run into the problem. Because uh, like uh, adage of those days, is those who marry beauty, they marry trouble. Mm. And really, they marry to trouble. Mm. Because you don't follow beauty. It happens to men, uh, ladies and boys. Don't follow that. Don't follow riches. Start life with the man you want to marry. If you choose, the man may not have anything. May not have anything. The only thing, the only thing you will observe, are you is it, is that man is it a true Christian? Is it a true Christian? And the background of the family, the careers, because whether it's educated, you have to watch all this. And where it's working, all these things you have to observe it so that you will not fall into a wrong hand because where you see you see a rich man you don't know how you got rich you will fall into it it's a problem that's what i always tell people be careful when i marry my husband he has nothing but i knew he was working i know i told you before yeah. yes I, I, when i show him to my mommy my mommy first before my father my mommy said i will not choose for you if you know that man can take care of you go ahead is when we I think we caught for a good three years. Hmm. Yes, before I agree, yes, and we married him. I was watching him, he too was watching me. How my marriage is going to be in future. That is very important. That is why you have to be very careful. Married somebody whom you love, not just because he has money or he's handsome. No, don't do that. If you do that, you are in trouble in future. Mm. It will not work. So you have to be very, very careful. Then another one, First Kings 7, oh no, Psalm 40. Eh, it teaches us, wait patiently for the Lord. Wait patiently for the Lord. And he will uh, incline to you. When you wait for the Lord, as I have told you, it's good you wait for the Lord. Put everything into him. Put your request to him. Tell God, this is the man I I, I, I feel I, I, I can marry. If, if it is the rightful person, he will remain. But if he is not a rightful person, during that, along that journey, you will see some mistakes in, on him that will make you to say, no, this is not the rightful person. So we have to be, we have to wait. Don't rush. Some people, they were caught for six months, three months. They said they have seen a man that they will marry. At the end, the marriage will not work. Mm. It will, 
the disappointment to wake up. Ah, I didn't know you are like this. The man will say, I didn't know you are like this. You too will say, I didn't know you are like this. That's the problem because you did not study yourself very well. So, we will cut it short. Forsake immorality, life. You know immorality, life. Hmm. Yes. You, that's what I, said, I told you earlier on. Immorality, life. Because the man is watching you. Whether you are faithful or you are loose. That's why you have to be very, very careful. That's all. Stop that. To round everything up, give your time to God. When you give your time to God, God will surely direct you. Yes, he will know this is my child. He will not allow you to go into wrong hand. Mm. That's, it. That is, that's to round it up. I pray that uh, God will help you with all this. Yeah, God will help you. Mm. So this is also for even the guys. They mm. can also take advice from this. From this, it's yes. not just for only girls. Not for not, like, not for only girls. Like came from a female perspective, but like you can also like apply mm -hmm. so many of things that Grandma said into your own life. You mm -hmm. know, prayer, fasting, mm -hmm. seeking the face of God, mm -hmm. being patient, not just rushing into uh, it uh, because uh, uh, of her physical appearance, appearance. and everything. Like Grandma said, that adage again that you said about beauty. By beauty, those who married beauty, married trouble. <laughs> those who married beauty, married they, they married trouble. Wow. Ah, that lady is too fine. That guy, oh, is too fine. Yeah. Because many people will be will be running after him. Mm. Yes, be, with 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 that beauty and the, because he's handsome, you know, he he, he, he won't be. Is it will be difficult for you to control him because mm. many people are after him. That's why you have to be very careful. I feel like so many people should seek character. Character. It's and that's very, like something very important. That so many people don't look at today. They don't like, look at it. They don't look at it. It's just mostly about like physical appearance, appearance. or what the guy has. Yeah. But the character goes a long way. Oh, no. Because, yes. you know, talent can take you there. But yes. it's character that keeps you that in that That keeps place. you, yes. I think that's very important. It's very, story. very important. Character. Yeah. Character. And marry somebody whom you love. Not because of uh, physical appearance, he's handsome and uh, he's, uh, he's having money. No, it's not. It doesn't work mm. that way. It doesn't work. Not that it's not good to marry a rich man, but uh, sometimes it doesn't work well. Mm. Yes. So we have to so be very careful. Because there's so many people who are like putting on makeup, but on the inside they are so miserable in like their marriage. They are married. That is it. So many things like that. Like so so many things like that. Don't just chase after money. Yeah, chase after, after money, character. After character. So we have to be very careful. I I did all this and it works for me. I think my marriage now is uh, since 19, uh, 1960. We married in 1965. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's about how many years? That's 54 years ago. 54 years of marriage. Yes, 54 years of marriage. Wow. And I have, not, not that you will not face any trouble. Mm. It will come. But how do you handle it? That's the thing. It's prayer. Yes. Because sometimes, you know, men, they misbehave. It's because they, there's no doubt that you will not cross that. But it's by prayer. When you are prayerful and you hold on to Christ because God directed you, you have laid your, the foundation of your marriage mm. on Christ. You, no matter how the temptation comes, God will help you to handle it. That is it. That's so powerful. Mm, wow, yeah. So I'm just going to end it with a prayer because like mm -hmm. Michelle, like we always pray mm -hmm. like at the end. Mm -hmm. But just just thank you for today. Thank, thank you for Jesus. the ability to just speak for you to just speak through us, oh Lord, Father, Lord, I pray, Lord, that this will not be as a condemnation to anybody, but this will be a conviction, mm -hmm. and this would lead so many people to choose the right person, choose the right partner, mm -hmm. and that they will even be patient to even wait for the one that you have chosen for them, oh Lord. Mm -hmm. Father, I pray, Lord, I just thank you for Grandma and her thank wisdom, you, Lord. I pray, Lord, that you keep her, Lord, that you guide her, thank Lord. Jesus. Father, I thank you, Lord, for everyone who has watched, oh Lord, that we will take this advice and we will hold on to it. Mm -hmm. We will not just listen. Oh Lord, we'll also be hearers and doers of this word, oh Lord. Thank you, Lord, for everything you do in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank Amen. you so much for watching. Thank you. Thank you. Like, Bless you. subscribe, Bye. share <laughs> to everybody you know. Amen. Share this video. Amen. And yeah, let people be blessed. Amen. Let people know, you know, like, right things to do. Like